Hello everyone and welcome back to Super Star Arcade. And more blood will be spilled. In the last episode, we encountered audio problems. Oh, there we go. Uh, Ramirez, the guy we're after. As I was saying, Ramirez, the guy we were after, sent his army after us, but we helped to ace over here, push them back. Boy, this is it. <laughs> Ramirez's fortress is right across this bridge. We're almost there. Well, that's a hell of a bridge. What's the plan, Sarge? Oh, no, no, there ain't a plan. Honestly, I, I, I never thought we'd make it this far. <laughs> thought we'd just go down in a blaze of glory. But it looks like our counterattack succeeded, and we've got them on the run. So, I say that we... Sergeant, sir, scouts are reporting a massive retreat of enemy forces. Yes, yes, we already know that. Uh, I was just saying that we... But they're abandoning their defensive positions, sir. It's an evacuation. That's, uh, suspicious. Bloody hell. Ramirez would never give us even an inch of ground without a fight. No, this can only mean one thing. That mad bastard wants to blow up the bridge! You sure about that? Sounds like a pretty desperate move. Well, I'm dead sure he's not doing it to grant us a safe passage across. Listen, some of us can fly, but none of us can swim. So if this bridge goes down... All right, you keep me covered, Sarge. I'll go check the bridge for explosives. Awesome. Well, hurry, lad. And be careful. This is an old bridge in the middle of a war zone. It might be falling apart even without explosives helping it. Alright, awesome. So that's what we gotta do. Now, I could go down there. Oh no, it's the only way. There's an invisible wall there. Sergeant was right. There are three explosive charges here, and the time is running out. Okay, alright, so that's the order they're in. First charge is down, two more to go. Uh, I can't see below me, which is a problem. Okay, what's over here? Awesome, alright. Okay. Hey, what? Why can't I? Oh, 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 it's one of these. Uh, oh, these ladders are going to kill me. Oh, come on. Seriously, how do I get down? Alright, I'll have to go for the other one. Or not. Oh, oh, that's how you're supposed to get through these. Wait, can I shoot these? No, I cannot. Only one dynamite left, but it's still enough to bring this whole bridge down. Alright, come on. Okay, how do I... Oh, oh, there's something shining there. There we go. Oh, I get it, I get it. I have to constantly create platforms. I might actually not make it, oh god. Shoot! Alright, come on, come on, come on. Alright. Alright, there we go. Oh, jeez. Right, there we go. Wait, where is it? Alright, I'll come back when we actually complete this. So, just to show you how broken the game can be, I'm stuck here. All I can do is turn left and right. Pausing does nothing, you know, switching guns doesn't do anything. So, I just kind of have to sit here now and... Yeah, like, there's nothing I can do. I'm somehow stuck. 
that's fun. And we made it. Oh wait, oh wait, we still have to keep going. Oh, okay, but the time limit's done. Eh, okay, that's good. Oh. <laughs> we ain't leaving without this. Oh, it's just more health. Right, which way are we supposed to go? Because there's a few ways. Jack! The cavalry's here! Nice of you to join us. Seems that not all the mercenaries fled the battlefield. Alright, so my first action is... Whoops, nope. My first action here is going to be to move. I'm going to move up here. Use the... Derringer to finish this guy off. And then I'm gonna see if. Uh, whoops. It's a good thing I can reload for free. And then. Okay, Was born I... to raise hell. Oh, I actually get to play as. Okay, so shoot, two damage. Whiskey. Oh, so instead of blood, this guy has whiskey. Okay, okay. Sorry, I just gotta move my chair a bit. Uh, hold the line. Ace drinks his whiskey and takes out the spades flag, which makes him invulnerable to damage and taunts his enemies. Shoots a barrage of bullets. Okay. If I were to do this... Let's see if it would work. Uh, all it really did was hit that one guy. Um, okay, so his. Right, let's see if his gun can. His gun sucks. Like his gun's all over the place. But I think I still took that guy out. Oh wow, there is a lot more guys than I thought there was. Is that a rhino beetle? Is that what that's supposed to be? You asked for this. Okay, so what's the play here? Try jumping down here. This bridge fight might just be the whole episode. How far can I aim straight down? Huh, would you look at that? I can. No mercy. Um, I feel like this is the perfect situation for this. Because it can actually hit that guy in the air. Shoot him in the head. If this gun can aim. <laughs> okay, that hurt. Let's go over here to get some blood. Because it is a free action. There will be blood. Not a free not a free enough action for but it's not enough blood for a derringer. So we're just gonna come on, come on, low a bit lower. There we go. Thunder Thing I got him. And lightning! <laughs> Let's do this, because I think we can hit this guy multiple times now. Yes we can. Perfect use of that ability. Uh, 
I uh, don't really know what else to do. I guess we can go here. And wait. Oh, if we get him across the battlefield, he can come down and help us. Alright, so cool being able to use two characters. I think we get to use three. You asked at least, for this. At least that's what... That could be the last blood we need, but I'd rather not get shot. I'd rather not get shot up that bad. Let's move he here. Or die. Stand over. Smoking hmm. He's singing. Get him, boys. <laughs> you asked for this. Let's see if I can take him out in one hit. Thunder and lightning! <laughs> yeah, that took him out. Alright, cool. We're almost done. I think this is the last guy. Uh, but I don't think this is going to be enough to take him out because it's only two damage. Oh, nope. I, yeah, headshot adds one, I guess. Yeah, that's some nice blood. Seems like we made it across. No small thanks to you, lad. Yeah, I'll buy me a beer later. How much further to the fort? There should be a small village nearby. The fortress is right next to it. We should go then, before Ramirez gets away. Wait, wait. My soldiers need to regroup first. Our supply convoys are still on the bridge. See you at the gate, then. Okay, so I guess... Maybe it'll be like those things where, like, you start the battle and it... Oh, the music just stops. Now, you guys probably can't hear it because this game's audio quality is really bad, but they're supposed to be whistling in the background. Ayuda, por favor. El general. He... He wanted us to fight for him. We refused. They put the strong ones in chains and... and killed the rest. A man with a star came after that. We... We thought he came to help, but he took all the captives and left. He was a friend of El General. Did you hear our general call him Marshal? I don't know, senor. Por favor. Make them pay for what they've done. Poor... Oh, or, uh, hmm. Calaveras, those bastards. Hmm, alright. Yeah, yeah, I'll take another potion. And that's a checkpoint. Yeah, we can keep going. Try to get their attention while I attack their flank. What? I thought you were. And how do you propose I should do that? Start shooting, I guess. Think they'll right. let us in if we knock and ask nicely. <laughs> or should we use that cannon? We are using the cannon. Oh, but I have enough for high noon. How does high noon work? Okay, so we're going to cancel high noon. First, we'll use the Derringer to get this guy out of the way. Then we will move. I really want that one blood, but... 
I'm going to use the can instead. Really? That's no all it did? Alright, let's move you over to some cover. And... Let's see if this can hit anything. Didn't really do much. Man, we might not get to Rivera's this episode. Which would suck. that. Alright. These flying guys are a pain. May I? Man, that cannon could only survive one shot. That's, that's disappointing. Alright, let's see if I can About here. Or die, stand or run. Shoot them down with smoking gun. Okay, that took out that guy. Now we should probably try and move over here. Oh, Ace is a beetle. Or some kind of flying bug. I didn't realize that. Wow, Ace has a lot of health. Like an absolute ton. Destroy the gate inside. Wait, is there? Wait, is there another cannon? Oh, there is. In that case, am I supposed to? Oh, I get it. We don't actually have to finish everyone off. We just have to get to the other cannon. All right, I'll just use my full turn to move then. This is the perfect scenario for the Gatling gun. Okay, it actually admittedly didn't do much. That is, unless I can hit this guy. Nope, nope. His gun drops too much. That's okay. He can still survive it. You are going to be, of course, you're coming over to me. So are you. Oh, no, but you're going after him. <laughs> oh, the rhino. That. Leave him to me. Let me. I just gotta get up close to him. That's what I gotta do. Uh, if I remember correctly, I think this guy has three health and my gun is not an option. Uh, of course it's not. All right. Don't fire until you see the lights of their compound eyes. Where can I move to? You know 
what? Just for a bit of protection, I'm gonna move up here. Just kind of let him, because we just need the cannons to win, I think. So just let him chase us around. Shoot that bastard. Unless they can shoot up through the ceiling. Come here, you bastard. They shouldn't be able to. Alright, so, so far the plan seems to be working, because we just go into an awkward area and then everyone has to move instead of actually hitting us, unless they go that way. Can I actually make it to the can- okay, no, alright, they're blocking the way, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, okay, friend. That drops him. Gotta wait next turn. Okay, got it. No okay. surrender. Let's go over here to provide some cover for Jack. I, I e, uh, Ace is gonna be a, a human shield. Or bug shield? Meat shield? Not meat? Not even meat shield because oh. he's. Cause I don't think bugs are considered meat. I mean, like I know some bugs like are very high in protein. And there are people who actually, like, order and eat bugs, right? But, I don't know. Okay, that missed, thankfully. So I actually really like the design and concept of this game. Like, this, this kind of RPG style, it's very cool. Uh, do we now have to go there, or do we have to finish everyone off? That is the question, I think. I could stand here for one blood. You know what, that seems smart. Oh, it won't let me. Okay, well, in that case, um... I don't know, shoot this guy, I guess? I don't even think I have to aim for his head. And lightning! <laughs> okay, perfect. So I can go over here and then use our last Gatlin, and that should be able to take care of the beetle guy. Or, actually, wait, no, I don't think I've hit the beetle guy once, so he might still be at full health after this. It almost took him out. It almost took him out. Why does that guy only have one health? I don't remember hitting him. Unless I was able to shoot through the floor. Yeah, that's a headshot on Jack. <laughs> My turn. Yeah, we're just gonna have the flying guy follow us, so I'm going to go up here and then see if I can shoot through the floor. In theory, I should be able to, no problem. Now I just gotta make sure I don't hit the barrels. Boom! Or die. Stand or run. Shoot them down with smoking gun. Okay, so that puts an end to him. Where is the last guy? He's over there, so we're going to move here for some cover. I still can't figure out if we actually have to finish off everyone, or if it's just get to the door. My turn. Well, regardless, I'm going to go over here for some blood. And then... Let's move again to here for some cover. Thunder! 
and lightning! <laughs> down here with Jack. So I gotta say, the art style is amazing, and the music, like, before the music was super repetitive and annoying, but it's gotten a lot better, and I really enjoy it now. Alright, come on. Get down here. Let me. Okay, so we can't shoot through there. So that means we have to move. Okay, so I'm going to move I'm gonna move here because it pretty much puts me eye level with this guy, which is gonna make taking him out real easy. Alright, uh Derringer. Oh come on! The, the, I should be allowed to use the blood suck ability. Wow, uh, he looks real nervous. Pop. Ha! -ha I don't want to live forever, mate. Alright, let's see. I can head up. No, no. All right. Up, up. That's still all one move. So as long as I can hit this guy in the head, I think we're good. And there we go! Finally! And that's still worth three blood, which means we did a good job. No point in waiting for the rest of the squad. Ramirez might get away. We should move. That bastard has to pay for what he's done to those people. Agreed. But Ramirez is mine. Uh, we'll see about that. Let's go. That is also one thing I've noticed about both of their character designs. Both of their character designs have one single, like, glint on their character. Now, for Jack, it's actually important because it's the bullet on his head, which, on his hat, which is the exact same bullet that in Mementos, which says a suit, which is referred to as his souvenir. Um. Uh, but for... Ace, it's just his uh, belt buckle. Ooh, dynamite. You know what? I think we can tag this on to the episode as long as his boss fight doesn't take too long. If this actually is his boss fight. Senor Jack the Cripple and the incompetent drunken sergeant. <laughs> what a fine duo you made. I have to say, that was quite an entrance. I figured you'd like explosions, since you wanted to blow up the whole bridge and all that. <laughs> yes, the bridge. Marshall wanted me to buy him a little more time. You've meddled with our plans enough already. Where is he, Ramirez? I don't think you'll be needing that information. In your grave? <laughs> hmm. What are you all looking at? Shoot him! That's a lot of mercenaries. Guess that Gatling over there might help even the odds a little. But if that Gatling won't hit any of them. Oh, is Ramirez not even here? I might just cut this fight out. I really don't know yet. Fine, let's see what this Gatling can do. Let's see if it hits anyone. It hit one person. Okay, we're just gonna walk up and stab him. Oh! There's a 
bottle. That does three damage. That's nice. Maybe you're not supposed to use the cat line until later, but like very rarely do you actually get enemies lined up nicely. I really don't like that beetle going after anyone but Ace. Ah, oh, great. Where's that gonna land? Yeah, this. Right, where, did... where did that dynamite land? Alright. Blood suck. Blood for blood. Which is perfect. And then Derringer. And will I get more blood if I walk over him? I will, which is enough for another Derringer. Was born to raise hell. Okay, you can't move very far, so we're gonna throw you up here. Can you use the Gatlin more than once? I wonder. Come here, you bastard! Oh, he can shoot. He can shoot through the floor. That's not good. That's not good at all. But if I can use the Gatlin more than once, then that Rhino is in the perfect spot for me to use it. Never mind, that guy's smart enough to know that I would go for it. Oh, never mind, I can't even reach it. How delightful. Alright, well, let's go... I guess we'll go up here and see how much damage we can do in a single turn. But these guys have a lot of health, so this, this could be a very risky play. Alright, so first off, Derringer straight to the head. And it only did one damage. Okay. Uh, so in other words, this is uh, not going to end well. Ha -ha! I don't want to live forever, mate. Right, we need to get out of the way. So of that explosion. Although that explosion may still very may very well still hit us. Um, actually, this is a great place to use Gatlin because I can hit that guy down there. Or, never mind, I guess I can only hit that guy. So this is interesting, so there's actually going to be points where it's advantageous to skip my turn and go straight to Ace. Hmm. Yeah, we gotta get rid of that dynamite guy, because he's causing issues. Ah, oh, that two blood looks good, but I can't take it. Okay, so let's... Let's go over here and see what we can do. Okay. I don't think we can... Oh, no, we can, so that drops no him. Mercy. Go here and yeah, sure. We'll try and use this. All right, that's one way to get rid of the. Okay, that's the first bit of damage Jack's taken all round. So that's that's good. That's that's good. Oh, I gotta reload first. Man, 
was wondering why everything was grayed out. Can I snipe this guy? Okay, because I got I gotta land a headshot. There we go. Now can I move down to him? I cannot. That is unfortunate. Because I really wanted to. Actually, wait, before I go down, can I hit this guy? No, I can't. He's completely covered by the box. So. Uh, because I don't want to get hit, I say we move down here. Maybe I can bait that guy in the coming Thunder down. And lightning! <laughs> if I. Like, I know he's aiming at me, but if I run to the box, am I technically protected now? Well, not from him, obviously. I am. Awesome. And the reinforcements have arrived. Okay, so we are going to um, just... Throw him over here. Yep, uh, have fun with that, guys. Uh, oh, I cannot jump back up. Coming down here was a mistake. Thunder and lightning. <laughs> okay, so we want to start by shooting that guy. And now we'll shoot this guy. I can't tell if I got him or not. I forgot these guys move. Alright, this is a problem. So, see, this is a problem with dynamite, is they always move, so you can never actually, like, hit anyone with dynamite. You asked for this. Unless, like, I try to play it smart and, like, throw dynamite right at my feet in the hopes that this is where they'll walk next and then just book it. Oh, that's as far back as I can go. That is an issue. No surrender! Okay, where can I go? Wow, Jack can move a lot. Let's go here. Maybe draw some fire on us. And, of course, they move away from the dynamite. You can't win with dynamite. No, no, wait, no. See? Still can't win with dynamite. All it did is destroy some potential cover for me. That might not have been the right move, but it's the move we're going for. Or die. Stand or run. Shoot them down. We're smoking gun. <laughs> Alright, that just leaves one left. And of course I couldn't beat him in one turn. Alright. I think I'll leave this battle in just because, you know, it, it's it's climatic Marcher. and Okay, can I, like, snipe him from all the way over Oh, no, he's, he's behind a barrel. Okay, so... Man, I can't even run fa far enough to collect the blood from the rhino beetle. Ha ha! I don't want to live forever, mate! And... And just, uh, finish it off. There we go. Yeah, good enough for me. Can I talk with Ace? No. I did not mean to use the health potion. That was a mistake. All right. Uh, I'm going to try and fit all this into one episode. Or maybe not? More platforming? Really?
Like, we already had, like, the cartoon, like, cutscene and everything. Or comic book cutscene. Like, why are we still... Okay. Oh, yay, some stairs. Oh, what's this? El Dorado part. All right, so I think that brings us up to five. Uh, so just one more. And uh, I'm hoping the El Dorado is the best gun in the game because uh, they are not giving us enough money to uh, reasonably get any other gun. I like how this is like a mix of like clay buildings, but also like kind of like hives. Like you can see like they, they're built kind of like wasp hives. I, I like that. I like that. Well, I guess not clay. These are very clearly brick buildings, but. Can I take anything in here? Can I shoot down his chandelier? I cannot. Oh, wait. Memento. Nice. And, uh, we've reached a checkpoint. Oh, is it just gonna be a straight duel on top of the- Oh, this would be cool. <laughs> you know, Jack, I'm not angry with you. We can still talk about this like caballeros. Like, gentlemen, you butchered a whole village, killed hundreds of soldiers, and tried to kill me on more than one occasion. What is it exactly you'd like to talk to me about? This would have happened if it weren't for your interference. Your actions forced us to do it. With the abrupt stop of the gold shipments from the Rusty Rokas, I had to look for other means of income. God's know maintaining an army this large isn't cheap. So you turned to raiding and plundering, huh? And what about those people you kidnapped from the village? What use does Marshall have for them? A Calaveras running a slave business now? I was never given that information, nor have I ever asked. He required bodies, and I delivered. In exchange, I was given freedom to do whatever I wanted down here. Jack, amigo. This is bound to end badly for one of us. But I can offer another solution to the situation at hand. Ooh. Is this actually going to be a choice? I can help you find Marshall. You know it's him that you really want. All right. No, Ramirez. I want all of you. Oh, okay, never mind. And I had you for a smart man. Draw then, you filthy bloodsucker! Oh, is Ace not going to join us? Alright. I can work with this, though. Alright. First, I gotta get in range. Uh, he's behind the box, so we're gonna start up here. Headshot. Oh, that's a lot of health. Alright, but that's... Okay, so he does, he does quite a bit of damage, um, but this is just going to be a straight up war of attrition. It's, it's really just going to be who falls first. Um, and I'm hoping it'll be him, because as long as I get headshots, I get an extra bit of damage every time. But he also gets to shoot me twice. Okay, alright, so the person who's going to fall first is me. Um, now let's start by taking the potion. Heal up. Alright, and now let's shoot again. Alright, that's one health bar down. Oh, okay, so he's now shooting four times. Alright, so uh, that means we need to move. So let's go over here. And just... Shoot from here. 
I'm still shooting him in the back of it. Oh, never mind. We're dead. Oh, nope. Nope. Just. He just barely missed us. So. We're going to go down here because he can't shoot from the floor here. Alright, I think we got this. I think as long as we just keep playing this smart, I think we've got this. Okay, reload. Man, it is such a good thing I got that free reload. Alright, now the question is, do I run? Oh, the answer is yes, I run. Because there's some health down here. And there's some blood over there. Let me. Why? Okay, this makes no sense. Why would he do this? He just kind of puts himself straight into range. Now he has one health left. I want to see if I can finish him off with a, a blood sucking move, because that would be awesome. Uh, yeah. Nope, just a knife. Eh, close enough. Just as long as he doesn't suddenly have a second form. And there we go. Man, that was easier than the last boss. How do I find Marshall? There is a, a woman. She works with Marshall closely. If you find her, you'll certainly find him. Did they just not record him saying Vanessa? He's a bastard, but he's not even worth a blood. He doesn't deserve revenge is a kind justice. Uh, I think for this run, we're just going to take everyone alive. You got what you wanted. Now, are you going to let me live? At least for the time being. Get up. And try not to bleed out till we get to Driftwood. Gotta say, I love the music, though. Absolutely love it. Cat's freaking out again. Bounty on Ramirez. I'm here to collect. Another job well done, sir. You truly are a professional. Why is your voice so loud compared to everyone else's? I believe everyone will sleep much better knowing that Ramirez has been brought to justice. By the way, there was a gentleman asking about you. I believe he's a fan of your work. Hmm, wonder who that is. I'm scared to ask. Unless it's... Oh, it might be Ace. Ace might be here, but I want to... Oh, I can't talk to Ramirez, but I can talk to you again. Getting along with your new neighbor, Sullivan? I ain't your guts, Jack. Not only that you failed to die once again, but you dragged this mad bastard in here who won't shut his mouth for even a minute. If you hadn't let yourself get captured like a stupid, useless bastardo that you are, I would not be here either, amigo. So it's my fault, you murdering son of a mite. Was it me who went crazy in the head and decided to set the whole south on fire? See? It is you who can't be trusted with taking care of stupid minds if you maintain the gold shipments. If you and your stupid little toy soldiers kept your end of the deal and kept sending me people, 
Lucia said he had need for them elsewhere. And where would that be? Even if I knew, I see no reason why I would tell you, Jack. Ah, I'm shot on both of you. You're making my head hurt. I've had enough with you, buggers. So that's actually super interesting that they interact with each other. Most of the time, they don't do that. Which means you, there's probably a unique interaction if you killed him and brought him in alive. Or vice versa. Um, yeah. Alright, and in the next episode, we'll go into a tavern and I'm going to assume it's Ace. So, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. And as always, stay safe. Have fun, and have a great day.